You are watching part 3 of the video series on Java Levit. The Epsilon Garbage Collector is a special purpose garbage collector introduced in Java 11. Unlike other garbage collectors, Epsilon does not perform any memory management. It simply allocates memory but never reclaims it, making it useful for performance testing, debugging, and scenarios where memory management is handled externally. Let look at a detailed explanation of the Epsilon Garbage Collector along with an example. To enable the Epsilon Garbage Collector, you use the XX plus use Epsilon GC JVM option when starting your Java application. Let's consider a simple Java application that creates a large number of objects in a loop but does not perform any explicit memory management or garbage collection. Running this application with the Epsilon Garbage Collector enabled will demonstrate that the application runs without any garbage collection overhead, as the Epsilon Collector does not reclaim memory. Here are some use cases for Epsilon Garbage Collector. First, performance testing. Epsilon is useful for performance testing and benchmarking, as it allows you to isolate the performance of your application from the effects of garbage collection. Second, debugging. Epsilon can be used for debugging memory-related issues, as it can help identify memory leaks and excessive memory usage by not reclaiming memory. Third, specialized applications. In some specialized applications where memory management is handled externally or where memory usage is not a concern, Epsilon can be used to simplify the GC configuration. There are some limitations for Epsilon Garbage Collector. First, since Epsilon does not reclaim memory, it is not suitable for long-running applications or applications with large memory requirements. Second, Epsilon is not intended for general-purpose use and should only be used in specialized scenarios where its limitations are acceptable. In summary, the Epsilon Garbage Collector is a no-op garbage collector that does not perform any memory reclamation. It is useful for performance testing, debugging, and specialized applications where memory management is handled externally or memory usage is not a concern. Hope this was helpful for you. Please check out our playlist for more videos. And also like and subscribe our channel for more such informative content. Good luck.